For nearly 300 days, Butch Wilmore and Sunita Williams have remained aboard the International Space Station, their return repeatedly delayed by a failed spacecraft meant to bring them home. What should have been an eight-day mission stretched into an ordeal of uncertainty. Now at last, relief is in sight. In a crucial step toward their return, SpaceX's Crew Dragon successfully docked with the ISS early Sunday, delivering four astronauts who will take over station duties and clear the way for Wilmore and Williams. The Crew-10 spacecraft latched onto the Harmony module at 12.04 a.m. EDT, securing its position before the crew made their way aboard. Crew-10 has had a great journey up here, about 28 hours to uh, get back up to the space station, and I cannot tell you the immense joy on the, uh, of our crew when we looked out the window and we saw the space station. For the stranded astronauts, Crew Dragon's arrival was more than just a routine crew rotation. It was their long-awaited ticket home. Wilmore and Williams launched aboard Boeing's Starliner on June 5, 2024, for a brief test flight. But the spacecraft suffered propulsion failures, forcing NASA to send it back to Earth uncrewed. With no alternative, the astronauts were forced to remain aboard the station, their return mission uncertain. Now, after months of delays, NASA has finally scheduled their journey back. Wilmore and Williams, along with Crew-9 Commander Nick Haig and Russian cosmonaut Alexander Gorbanov, will board Crew Dragon undock at 1.05 a.m. ET on Tuesday and make the long-awaited descent with splashdown expected near the Florida coast at approximately 6 p.m. Their extended mission, 286 days in space, will finally come to an end. What was meant to be a simple test flight turned into an unintended endurance challenge. Now only one final descent through Earth's atmosphere separates them from home.